a very happy, happy Tuesday. My hair, Karen's getting on me. She's making fun of me. I'm not really sure what I'm doing. I was letting the top grow out, and I've cut that, but I just haven't done anything on the sides yet, so you will have to excuse me, but Karen is making fun of me. But on to bigger and better things. It is the mini Scoterzilla, the Foamzilla, the Bulletzilla, the indestructible Surfzillas. They're moving along really nice, so check them out. I think they are working out really, really nice. I have to admit, I do have to admit, I've been doing just a little bit too much fishing. Karen's been off. When Karen's off, I don't like working on decoys. And even when Karen is at work, I've been going on fishing. So that's my biggest problem. But my number one problem is truly just managing and organizing. I, I, I don't know if I've got any of those ADHAs or anything like that. But man, like, I, I just go off on these tangents and I... I get sidetracked very easily, so I do have to admit, if I'm self-critiquing, that is one of my major problems, one of my major flaws. My organizational skills, my organizational skills in what I what I call it, um, I don't know what I would call it, not um, not motivation. I, I don't know what the word I'm looking for. If Karen was here, she would just say it, I, and it would, and she'd be correct. Just my, uh, I don't fail to plan, because I do plan things out. Because I do plan things out. Duke's out there getting angry. Little little baby rabbits everywhere else out there. But anyway, enough of my rambling. My problem is, is I get sidetracked. I'll admit that, and I'm going to own it. All right, let's look at them. I think that the mini Scoterzilla are working out very nice. I've kind of got to the point where, you know what? I, I need to float one. I really do. What I did today was I went ahead and, and, and basically just I cut my notch. I cut my notch in every one of them. And they're ready to be put together. I was being really diligent and, and measuring this out. And after about five or six of them, I could really just do it by eye. So I really could just do it by eye. I am really happy with them. I found that today. I found that today. Old school. Way old school. That's my mom's old phone number. The old house number back in the day. That banner circa 1999 or 2000 somewhere there i tagged the duck boat company in instagram today and they liked it i told them it is old it really is old but anyway back to the foam zillas the mini scoter zilla i'm liking them i'm liking them and i'm liking them some more so dana level again i've said it many times sir thank you very much for all your help and your motivation and coming up with these so i'm happy i'm happy but like i said one thing i need to do I need to get one of these together. And I think it's going to be this surf. We'll go ahead and put them together and float it just to see how it floats. One thing I'm not going to be too crazy concerned about is so we, we have that, that little trough that runs down them, right? So I'm painting these guys in oils and I'm going to seal with shellac. So the bodies will get sealed with shellac. And in here, I envision a nice strip. Well, actually, the whole body will be sealed. A nice strip of black paint right down here so that when I, when I attach the bodies, to the board i'm not i'm not going to be worried about sealing sealing that up right there so but i do want the wood protected but yeah that one needs to get done i, I envision of course we're going to have the the pit boss brand will be right there and i envision about nine ounces of lead i think i, I maybe i won't need it but i think that nine ounces of lead would be helpful so all right a very happy wednesday to everyone maiden voyage i guess I gotta test this one just because I gotta get one in the water just to see what's what. We're going with no weight on the bottom. I just wanna see 50 50 whether it's gonna self right. Let's see. Yeah, it's kind of what I thought. That's what I thought. All right, so that said, I'm solo here. Karen's inside. Let me try it again. wasn't too bad i still got about nine ounces ten ounces of weight that i do want to try oh it did okay oh now see there i think that my nine ounces will get we'll get it we'll get that flipped over that's kind of what i was worried about but nine ounces in the big picture they'll still be super light all right there's about nine ounces let's set it down then gently in the water there we go that's what i'm looking for that's what i'm looking for there we go in the mornings with long line i'm always towing them 
and the big Scoterzilla once. And see, there it doesn't. But there it does. Once, he really didn't. Once they're out, and I'm putting them out, and especially with the big flat bottom that they have, they always stay self-righted. So I want them to be as light as I can. So I think maybe, maybe I'll pour 10, 10, 11 ounce, something like that, and see how they do. I am happy. I am happy. The maiden float. I can't say voyage, but the maiden float. <laughs> That's all I got. It is the mini Scoterzilla. Oh, Duke, Duke. Bo, come on, buddy. Here. Bo. Bo might be trying to get away on me. Bo, here. Let's go. Eagle's going to come get him. The Eagle's going to be me. All right, come on. All right, they're being good. So back to the mini Scoterzilla. That truly is all I got. I got to get on the buffle head. I do have to get on the buffle head. And I've had an order of wood ducks come in. Cedar bluebill. And I'm going to need to make some cedar scoter. There's the rest of the buffalo bodies. Whew. Maybe this week will be good. And maybe not. It's hard to say. <laughs> it is. It is. As I always like to say, it is all good. If you have not, please. First off, Karen and I, we appreciate you following along with us. And if you have not, please subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. Thumbs up. You can give me a thumbs down if you do not like the mini Scoterzilla, the mini Foamzilla. So if you don't like them, I don't know why you wouldn't, but you can give me a thumbs down. Comment, question, share, ask me any questions you got. I will be happy to try to help answer anything. I'm not an expert, but I like to think I know a little bit about everything. So, And if for nothing else, we, everybody, you, me, and everybody else, we always have our opinions, right? So a very happy Tuesday. Wait a second. Right here. My George's Mixes is in my Fin City cup, my Hooper's Crab House cup, and my Sneaky Pete cup. Actually, got it at Sneaky Pete's. Mm. That's really good. We'll be doing a little Mexican cooking for Karen here in a bit, so I'm feeling like I needed a little bit of tequila. Maybe a little bit more. Mm. Tasty, tasty, and tasty. As always, sincerely, thank you for following along with us. I do appreciate it. Thinking of you, we are. Boom. Ha, ha, ha.